Hey guys, what it do? It's your boy Supreme Cheer the God. This is gonna be a quick and brief video, but I wanted to talk about Vasco, baby. Now Vasco fought Eli and listen, I kinda predicted that the only way that Eli or Warren Che would lose, uh not kind of, I actually pretty much predicted that the only way that they would lose would be by them giving up and allowing um you know the the allies to go through. And here I like how it's done. Um and let me explain. So, you know, I said that if, you know, Vasco or or Daniel fought Eli, Eli would win. Um, and he was dismantling Vasco. Vasco uh had a Zenkai boost that pushed him to the next level. And he he basically had an awakening and leveled up and then he started pushing Eli because Eli at first was just having his way with him. He was light work. Um, and then Eli saw that because, you know, Vasco was trying to save him, like Vasco, Mike, I'm, that's why Vasco was trying to save him. He was like, yo, like, listen, um, let us deal with, 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 with the workers. Let us deal with, with all these guys, you know, cause we know your situation. We know why you're doing what you're doing, but you should have relied on us. We are friends, rely on your friends. Like we are powerful. We will stop these guys. And Eli's argument was you guys are too weak to even defeat me how are you going to defeat a group that has my my family in shambles you know what i'm saying um how are you guys going to do anything if you can't even defeat me and so that's why vasco that's when vasco get, got his awakening and went to the next level and started pressing eli now eli was i think was going not i think it showcased he was about to block uh vasco's move and start countering and push himself further uh because i don't really think he was trying that hard because again they are friends you know he's going to stop you but he's not you know what i'm saying he's not play fighting as vicious as he normally does as we're well aware how vicious uh eli gets um and vasco you know obviously pushing himself showcase to eli like yo this guy is serious like this guy is leveled up in this short amount of time as well in order to try and save me and to stop this group that's been terrorizing all of us like and he was he was thankful i think at that moment he was thankful that he didn't have to weigh the burden himself uh because him and warren were weighing every burden and he knows that warren was only going with whatever he wanted to do and you know he didn't want eli to be alone again like he's been alone for years before he he warren refused so he said okay if you're going to be rogue i'm going to be rogue with you because you're my brother warren won his fight because he kept his 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 word he kept and you know and he's also not as uh he he does his relationship with with jerry is very physical is very fighting they've always just been fighting and it's to see who's actually stronger and obviously warren proved that he's stronger but eli's relationship with vasco and them is completely different um you know they were on the same side uh it's during the whole you know hostile initial main story they were on the same side um so it, it for, for vasco it was a shame you know and so it was beautiful to see that you know vasco a leveled up i think he looks stronger than i mean i you know we also saw zach level up but i think zach didn't have a zenkai boost during his fight he just he he already had a, a a way out of it and he just showcased it while vasco had all the moves but he something was holding him back and it was like an emotional thing or like a mental block and he he broke through that ceiling in in this fight um and that was beautiful to see so congratulations to vasco um eli finally trust these guys uh warren is out of the equation because his fight with jerry was crazy um vasco is in the best shape out of everyone zach is kind of mangled up i mean zach is always mangled up after a fight but i feel like he'll recover really quickly and i think hopefully the big three go out go up and do something together i really want to see a fight between the three of them fight properly together not that james lee shit where they got washed um apart from daniel so that's what i hope happens and uh, i'm excited to see what happens next congratulations to vasco finally getting a moment i think he's his moment was way better than than zach's uh because i think he fought a stronger opponent um as it's proven that eli beat a king solo um so you know and also it's a character that we care about while zach fought some random dude we don't care about 
So I think that's kind of the difference and the significance of it. I hope Zach finally gets his moment because he really hasn't been. But I'm glad Vasco got his moment. I just hope he never does that stupid ass move where he pulls his leg back again because it, it looks horrendous. I don't know what the auto is cooking there. But anyway, it's been your boy Supreme Chia the God. I'm excited to see what happens next.